guys, what's going on? It's Matt with another Nerf gun review video, and today we are going to be taking a look at the Nerf Rapid Strike CS18. That's right, guys. This gun is a full auto machine gun, and I like to refer to it as an M16 <laughs> because it is very similar to an M16. Uh, this gun is actually very, very good. It shoots very far, and it shoots very fast. So, so uh, it's probably one of the best guns you can have in battle, and it's also not that heavy. So, um, the, uh, actually, there are many pros and cons of this gun. I think I'd, um, I'll actually start with the pros. Um, so, basically, this gun is, um, as I said, it's full auto. And all you do is pull this acceleration trigger right here. You hold that while you hold this. And you can keep pulling it like that, shooting it. If you want, um, it's a very nice gun, very nice gun. Um, a lot of tactic reels on it. There's one here on the bottom, one on this side, one right here, one on the top, and another one on the top right here as well. Um, so one, two, three, four, five tactical reels. You have your jamming door right here, which is nice. And it's kind of a clear gun because you have the jamming door, which is clear, and then the clip, which is clear, which is actually the next thing. It's an 18 round clip and it's clear which is nice um it says the nerf thing right there and it says 18 uh so it's a very nice clip and i like how there's like the rubber corners which is pretty cool now you can put any kind of clips into this gun like a 35 drum magazine 25 drum magazine 18 drum magazine um six star clip i don't know why you would want to but you can really literally fill this up as much as you want um and um <clears throat> It has a nice, beautiful grip right here, right on the bottom. Just kind of put your fingers right there. And, um, doop. <laughs> so it's a very nice gun, also a nice handle. You have a bandolier or sling adapter here, here, and, um, here. <laughs> up front, right by the iron sight, which actually flips up and flips down. And the barrel is actually pretty nice, so you can put, like, a recon barrel on it or, yeah. Um, you got retaliator barrel on it, which is pretty nice. Um, it has the nice adjustable stock right here, and all you do, whoops. Okay, you pull it out, and to push it in, you have to pull this trigger right here. And I don't know why this little piece right here maybe holds a clip. I'm not sure. I haven't figured that out yet. But um, it does have the Nerf symbol and the N Strike symbol over here. And same thing on the other side. And um, I think let's talk about the um these sights. So as you can see, you have a nice lineup right here. I don't know if you can get a good angle. All right, there we go. And um, that connects to this. It goes all the way through, and you can literally look through it. It's kind of like a mini scope, which really lines you up nice, and it's really nice. Um, this kind of acts as a handle right here, and of course, the sight goes right through the soap. You have your finger in here or around here. You won't be able to see it. Um, and you can have this down in case you don't want to have the little iron sight, but, uh, it's very useful. And, um, um, this was, um, pretty nice gun. Uh, let's see. So, oh yeah, clip release. So, the clip release is actually pretty nice. All you do is, um, push this switch forward right here, and it just kind of comes out. Um, and sometimes if you want, you can have, like, you just push it with your finger, and then just, uh, finger push it out. Just saying you could do that um but it is a very nice gun i do recommend it definitely and for range i'd say it shoots around 50 to 60 feet which is really nice um this gun i got last year for christmas eve actually i went to my friend's party and um i got it so um shot even farther then but um it's a very nice gun you have a nice cheek rest right here which is really comfortable, and I really like how if the stock is too long for you, you can adjust it and push it in, in case you want it like this. That's kind of like a mini Uzi, I guess you could say. Um, though, one thing that I notice is when you're resting your cheek on the cheek rest, your eye's kind of above the sight, as you can see mine is a little bit, and you can't see straight through it unless you literally have your eye like this. But the cheek rest is there for a purpose, so I don't really know what that's about. That's probably the only con I can actually think of, believe it or not. But, um... This gun is really nice, and uh, it's really cool how it shoots. I really like the front piece and how there's the, like, little spaces right here. It's a really nice gun, um, and I like it a lot. So, um, 
that is going to be all for today's Nerf Gun Review, guys. Oh, yeah, one more thing. I'm sorry, it does come with the blue streamliner dots. Um, there's one over there. I just don't want to reach up and get it. And that's my phone ring. So um, let me go get that, and I'll see you guys next time. Just please make sure you know what to do. Please subscribe to my channel, like, and comment. Uh, and that'll help me a ton. Tell your friends about me. Just tell me. <laughs> tell anybody. Just get more people to watch my vids. And, um, yeah, that's going to be all for today's video, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.